Yeah, I dropped it down to 40 foot, so he ain't going to go below that. Hi, I'm Wayne Webb, and good morning. Once again, it is early in the morning. It is 6 a.m. I am here in Nove Gardens, an absolutely lovely little spot, and probably a spot that a lot of people who come to Weymouth that will miss. You might hear a lot of crows in the background. They are quite noisy. Right, I was thinking about flying a drone down this path. If you look behind me, might be a bit dangerous for the drone. And actually, there could be people. Yeah, a cyclist just came bombing down here, so I don't know if it is a good idea to fly a drone. We've got this glorious view. No, no garden sign. And yes, I have a new gimbal for my camera. So after the original Ronin SC failed, after less than 24 hours, the uh, motor arm lock button decided to stay unlocked forever. I sent it back for a refurn and upgraded to the DJI RSC2. So I will do a video on this at some point once I've used it enough. But for now, let's go find a spot and let's uh, take a look around. All right, do I dare fly the drone down there? Doesn't look very pretty from this. <laughs> This way, look at that. Bloody rubbish everywhere. It's the only problem. Sunday mornings, there's absolutely trash everywhere. <sighs> and just for a record, it's a very big sporting night tonight. Yes, England got to the final of the Euros. So I don't expect to sleep much tonight. I live in the center of town, so it's gonna be absolutely mayhem if we win. These parking signs are usually good and give you information whether you can fly a drone or not. Not that they can stop you. As I have been corrected a few times now, I incorrectly assumed that no fort was part of the National Trust. It's not part of the National Trust. And as many people correctly state, they don't have control of the airspace anyway. You go on their website and they actually say it's still a grey area and it's something the government are looking into. Hopefully they do nothing about it like everything else. <laughs> we shall see. So yes, I am going to fly over the fort today. Nice open area, see there. Dull grey day. I just need to get out. It's been a while since I've taken the drone out because of the crappy weather. And I need a video. I don't want to sit at my computer and show you Premiere Pro and all that boring stuff. Let's get out, fly. Let's see if I can challenge myself a bit today with all these trees. Doesn't always beep. Sometimes you get a really loud beep after pressing cord and uh, I don't know why. Maybe my volume's down. My volume's down. Let's go up. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. We got pigeons crows, all manner of birds, so hopefully they don't chase my drone down. Hopefully we don't get any low flying choppers at this time in the morning. Right, let's go up. That's forward, and up we go.
wind's decided to pick up a little bit. It's not horrible. That's something you want to happen while you're out to sea and the wind just decides to pick up all of a sudden. Well, we've got some good shots there, so went over the fort. It's a lot of common sense down the end of the day. There was some stupid idiot decided to fly their drone <laughs> very close over the fort during a remembrance silence. I'm here early in the morning. There's no one inside the fort, no crowds. So if you are a bit, mm, I don't know if I can or not. So they can't control the airspace. It's not theirs to control. I could be an idiot and fly down in, <laughs> into the fort from above, but I'm not that stupid. All right, time to change the battery, 20%. Do some of those shots I practiced uh, not too long ago, shall we? Might be the windiest conditions I've flown in so far. All right, I'm <laughs> this might seem silly, but just looking at the level of the tree over there. So I want to fly lowish over in that direction, do that old lift the camera as I did last time. So I've seen videos of people flying the drone in a lot worse conditions than this, so I should be okay. Line up my shot. Let's see if I can do it on the first take. <laughs> Not likely. Now this is a shot I want to try. This is getting a bit more creative, I think. I want to come from that side, coming towards the fort. The fort entrance is just behind the camera. Now, thankfully, a guy just came walking his dog in this direction. So I need to stand at this end to make sure no one's coming across this path. So I stand over there and the drone comes through here, hits someone because it's quite low. <sighs> Yeah, I really want to try this shot. Hmm. I hope this works. I was a little bit nervy and you know, our drone was drifting quite a bit so going through that tunnel was a bit hair raising so I'm not really used to enclosed spaces yeah I've been very used to big open spaces so now I need to practice in something a little more uncomfortable 
now I'm down at Stone Pier and I want to catch a fishing boat going out the harbour. So I'm going to wait around here for a bit. There's a few anglers on the piers. Nothing to be concerned about. See the fort just here. So let's wait a bit. So before my batteries run out, I just want to say thank you for watching. See you next time.